Hey guys, let's discuss this problem on probability. This problem says the following table gives the lifetime of the neon tables. Here, this table represents you lifetime of neon tables in hours from 300 to 400 hours, 400 to 500 hours and up to so on to 900 and 1000 hours. Number of lamps in these hours are 14, 56, 60, 86, 74, 62 and 48. Now from this given data, what do you need to find out? A bulb is selected at random. Find the probability that lifetime of the selected bulb is in the first problem less than 400 hours, between 300 to 800 hours, at least 700 hours. So you can see here number of lamps or number of bulbs, you can say anything. So there are 40 lamp, 14 lamps in the hour of 300 to 400 hours. So for the very first problem, when they asked you a bulb is selected and that bulb is selected with the life of 400 hours, less than 400 hours. So this will be this interval, 300 to 400 because this represents less than 400 hours. And how many bulbs are there? 14. Total number of, total number of bulbs are 14 plus 56 plus 60 plus 86, 74, 62 plus 48. This is going to be the total number of bulbs. Now let's calculate the probability in this case. Number of neon lamps with the lifetime less than 400 hours is equal to 14. Total number of neon lamps when you sum all these values you will get the sum as 400. Now probability of lamps with the lifetime of less than 400 hours out of 400 lamps. So, so there were exactly 14 lamps with the lifetime of less than 400 hours. So probability will be 7 is to 200 in this case. In this second problem, they ask between 300 hours to 800 hours. So you are going to sum all the values 14, 56, 16, 86 and 74 up to 74 because this will give you the time interval of 300 to 800. It should be less than 300, uh, uh, less than 800 and more than 300. So this will be this case. Now probability will be probability will be 290 total number of neon lamps 400. So ratio of 290 and 400 will give you the probability of 29 is to 40. Number of neon lamps with the lifetime of at least 700 hours. In this case what you will do lifetime should be more than 700. And here in this given data, it will be 74 plus 62 plus 48. So what this value will be? On summation, you will get 184. And as you know, total number of lamps are 400. So probability in this case will be 184 divided by 400. And this will give you the ratio of 23 and 50. Let me repeat for the second problem and third problem. What we have done here. Number of neon lamps with the lifetime of between 300 to 800 hours. So in this case what we have done between 308 and 8 hours lamps are 14 plus 56 plus 60 14 plus 56 plus 60 plus 86 plus 74. These are the number of lamps with the lifetime of 300 to 800 hours and this sum was 290 as you can see here. The sum was 290. Total number of lamps were 400, 400. That's why you got the ratio of 29 is to 40. In the third case, you needed to consider at least 700 hours. So what you have done? We have taken 74, 62 and 48 into consideration. Why? Because you need to take the lifetime of at least 700 hours. So this will be 74 plus 64 plus 48 and on summation you will get 184. On summation you are getting 184. So that's how you got the probability of 23 is to 50. I really hope there is no doubt in this solution. I will be taking more problems in the coming video lectures. Thank you.